Hey guys, uh, Lars Brubaker from Matter Hackers. Um, we have a little project today. We're going to make a custom plug for the bottom of this salt shaker. It didn't have one, so what we're going to do is we're going to use Matter Control, the software that we created for 3D printing, and uh, Image Converter, a tool that we made, and we're going to make a base for this little guy. All right, so I wanted to describe the first step. The first thing we need to do is we actually need to take a photograph of this hole so that we can bring it into Matter Control and the Image Converter and create the shape that we need. So I just took my iPhone and I took a picture and I mailed it to myself and uh, put it into Matter. So I just quickly wanted to show you our first step here. What we did was I took a picture of this hole and now I have it on the computer and I just need to go in and edit that picture. Get to the part that I need and uh, we're just going to crop out that section. So, just come up here and crop. And now I have a little teeny image that is the actual thing that I'm going to use in the software to make the image. So we're now at the next step. And what I need to do is I am just going to go here to the image converter. I'm going to run the image converter and I'm just going to take my image and I'm going to drag it onto there. And the image converter just automatically can figure that out and it made me a little shape that I can now save and exit. So I could print that right just from right here and go ahead and print that out. Uh, you can see it's the wrong size. So I now have my handy dandy calipers and I have measured that hole to be 11.22 millimeters and we're just going to go ahead and scale this to be 11.22 millimeters. So I come in here 11.22 and I set the dimension Oh, and so you can see that I, I didn't get exactly what I wanted, so we're going to turn back on the lock to scale, and I'm going to just do it again. 11.22 set. And so now I have the whole shape scaled the way I want it, and I'm going to turn off locking, and I'm going to scale the Z bigger. I actually want several millimeters of this to go up into the object. And I can save this. And that's my new shape. And I can print that out and it will fit into the object. But I actually want to put a little bit of a base around it. So uh, I'm going to do a little bit of work in OpenSCAD and put a base on there. You could do it in Blender, SCAD, whatever tool you have that can take this STL and modify it. So I'm not going to show that part of it. I'm just going to go ahead and get this thing modified now that we have the right shape. And I'm going to print it out. So I wanted to show you the part on the screen, then the part that we printed. It's exactly the same. And it's exactly the same size as the hole. It just fits right in there. Um, I need two hands to shove it in there, so hold on one second, I'll put it in there and just show you what it looks like. And that's it. I now have the plug that fits right into this salt shaker, and we'll keep the salt in it, so that when we uh, fill it up, it won't just pour out onto the table. Custom 3D printed plug. So I just wanted to give a little conclusion. Um, I actually made a base for the salt shaker and the pepper shaker, and they fit great, and uh, that was a really fun project. So. Hopefully, if that looks like something that would be of use to you guys or something similar, please let us know. We'd love to hear what kinds of things you can make use of in the Picture Creator and Matter Control. Thanks a lot.